Hey guys and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Black in English. Yeah, I'm at that sort of point right now where I thought I'm, I need to, uh, I, I didn't do a part yesterday. I know, my bad. The whole part of day thing didn't happen. Oh, straight into a rival battle, I completely forgot about this. Rival battle versus Sharon. So yeah, I didn't do a part yesterday. But I'm going to do two today because I missed a part yesterday. I'm still going to keep up with that. So I'm going to, there'll be two parts today, this one and another one. So yeah, yeah, rival Sharon. Um, pretty easy to deal with, like I say, his Pokemon haven't really changed, might have evolved a bit, I think. These were the left hardest, which is weak to fighting, so if you've got any sort of fighting move, you can kick its ass, just to punch it really hard, and it should go down. Give quite a good experience, like, you know, most Pokemon, obviously, that are level 2, 3, give them a lot more experience, so that's what you want to be doing. Hatu Poo, I think that's the evolution of his, um, starter. I, I, so, yeah, I think I had no idea what it was, so I just sent out Shimama, and, uh, no, 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 Hatapu is the bird. I'm completely wrong, sorry, that's why I sent out Shimama. It protects itself, but, hey, uh, I should be able to get the shockwave off this time. Quick attacks me, and it's critical, and because he's a effing annoying, Shimama has such a weak defense that it's just getting, it just get owned. I think I'm healing him up. No, 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 I just go for it. No, Shimama's down. Oh, he's such an annoying Pokemon, but I really want to keep using him. I want to I want to know where you can get Thunderbolt from, so I can buy that and really beat him up. But yeah, I sent that Yapu. God knows why. I think I tried to lick it to paralyze it, but then it wasn't affected. So uh, it protects itself, I use water gun, it misses. It's a really annoying Pokemon. <laughs> really annoying, because it's so quick. And uh, it's hits quite hard, surprisingly. And it's look at all these crits he's getting. I swear the crit ratio in this game is much higher than than it has been in past games. Uh, anyway, Muna, come on, Muna. Yes, there you go. Look, good on you, Muna. Well done. Level up. Uh, actually, uh, some people might be thinking, why haven't you level? Why haven't you evolved your Muna yet? Because I uh, got a Moonstone quite a while back. Why haven't you evolved Muna yet? Uh, I'm waiting until I think it's level 36. I believe, 35, 36, 37, that around that age, uh, range, she, she'll learn Psychic, and uh, obviously Psychic, really strong move, I know you can get it on a TM at some point, but I'd rather learn it to level up, so as far as I've read ahead, you don't really get it till later on in the game, and you have to find it as well, it's not a buy one, so, I really want to wait till she learns Psychic, to see if there's any good, good moves up there, then Evolve her. Because uh, obviously when you revolve by stone, which you will with Muna, she doesn't learn any more level up moves. Uh, which has always been the case with every Pokemon ever. That, well, that said Eevee. Eevee learned moves, didn't it? In red. I think it did. I don't know. Anyway, learn a cheeky Karate Chop here. Karate Chop's such good moves. Better than what I've got. I think it was... Uh, what was it I had? Rock Smash. Yeah, Rock Smash is a TM as well, so if I ever want it again... I can just put it on, but it was. I always check the power and accuracy of a move before I learn it, because if the power is stronger and the accuracy is the same, then why not keep? Why not swap to that, especially if it's got type of stab. So yeah, uh, Chabu is his evolved starter. That looks like just a mighty pig. Look at it. <laughs> Look at these guns. Got your tickets to the gun show. Don't worry, ladies. Don't worry, ladies. The safety's on. Kucha, kucha. Yeah. Uh, Chaboo's down anyway. Easily taken down. Taken down. I'm surprised I'm talking with so much gusto. I'm halfway through a subway right now. And I'm at that point where I feel full, but I really want to read the last half of it. You know how I mean. You know what I mean. Anyway, uh, oh, gym leader's back. She, uh, taking us to meet someone. Oh, yes, this dude. Recognize this dude because you'll be meeting him again later on. Uh, quite a few times, I believe. Uh, he's the champion. Yeah, not th this time, it's not a rival. Spoilers, but it's not a rival when you get to the, uh, when you get to the Elite Form beat it up. Uh, it is this guy, but I don't believe, um, but he's not the only guy when you get there. Just saying. It's really, it's, it's, it's an interesting Elite Four, because obviously you fight the normal Elite Four, but I think you can fight them in any order, unlike all the other games, which is, which is nice. That, I like that. Uh, if you think, if you know you can beat the first three, but the fourth one you're going to have trouble with, then you know you can swap them around. Uh, what are we doing here? I think we're just, he's just throwing us into a double battle just to see how we go, and yeah, we thrash him, because I think they use the monkeys. 
something. Something. They used something really simple. No, no, it's very, I can't remember. It was a while ago since I recorded this now. I should really get into the point of recording and doing this. I'm actually planning, not tomorrow, because I think tomorrow I'm going to work. I might do a beautiful gel. But uh, on Saturday, uh, I'm planning on just um, sitting down and playing Pokemon Black until my hard drive can't take no more. It can't take no more! And uh, un un uh, until it can't take more anymore. Data recorded, and then I'll just try and make as many parts because I uh, was in town today. And uh, Pokemon Black is out over here in England on um, 4th of March and I want to get this done by the 4th of March or around that time at least get into maybe the post game stuff uh, mostly first of all because um, obviously I want to move on I've been doing this healthy for a while now with all the problems I've had with this and that and other yeah whatever uh, but another reason is uh, views really <laughs> it's just, I can't want some views oh by the way there's an item over there to the left that you might have just seen pop on the screen I think it's an iron or a calcium I didn't bother getting it but it's there, I'm pointing it out. All these dudes are trainers down here, so you can fight all these people as well. But like I say, I want to get it done by that, so people can look up and know what they're doing. I mean, I would have thought there wouldn't have been any changes to the game except the localization translation. So obviously the translation might be a bit better and there'd be more stuff in, in English, obviously. But, uh, you know, people will still be able to play it. Right now, oh, I knew I forgot to do something going to town this weekend. Oh, and, uh, yeah, I evolved Yapu at this point because uh, I think it learned Boiling Water, which is a very strong water move. Obviously, it's main move that I'm waiting to get is Surf, high stab, strong power move. Uh, so I thought, you know what, why not evolve it now? I don't really learn anything else interesting that I can't teach you by TM, so yeah, Yapu evolved into Yaki. So happy with itself, doesn't it? Mm. Anyway, uh, currently I know for uh, Diamond, Pearl, Platinum, High Gold, and Soul Silver, there is Shiny, NT, Raikou, and Suicide over the next few weeks. Uh, but I don't have Wi Fi at home, which is annoying. The router doesn't, our router doesn't support Wi Fi, so I'm a. Uh, I don't know what that does. I couldn't find it anywhere. So I'm the electric guitar. Anyway, so uh, I need to go into town and use like McDonald's Wi Fi or something, but I forgot to do it today. I knew there was something that slipped my mind. But I can go do it this weekend, as long as I'm done by the 13th. I really want these shiny Raikou and Teen Suicide, just because they're pretty. Uh, you never know, I might buy one from that. Anyway, this person here, this is the maid. I remember I told you never to sell any fragrant mushrooms, big mushrooms, tiny mushrooms, etc. She will buy them off you at insane prices. 500 for tiny mushrooms, which you know, it's, it's pretty good, it's pretty good. Just wait, just wait. I think I'll sell her another tiny mushroom here. So. Yeah, so anyone that's... that's uh, I really want to get the, some views going because people need to look and realise and see what ha what's happening with it, if they need help or whatnot. Uh, with gym leaders, uh, I'm going to try and maybe start doing the annotations from it, but I am a bit busy, obviously, with my course, etc. Anyway, here, I sell... I sell a... Where is it? Where is it? Where are you? Big... No, that's not it. Tiny mushroom. Another tiny mushroom. Yes, I'll give you the tiny mushroom for 500. I found it on the floor, so for me, this is a bonus. Wait, did I not? I must have sold it. You must have seen how much it is. I completely missed it. Oh well. Uh, if you go around here, there's another item. Cheeky Hyper Potion. But uh, that's actually quite a short part, this, looking at it. It's only like 11 minutes, so uh, I'll definitely put up a second part today. I'll probably just follow through with the uh, narration straight into the next one. Oh, another old guy. Oh, trainer, let me show you true art, okay? Blah, 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 blah. That's true art. Uh, my repel wall, that's a pain. Yeah, I'm using, trying to use as many repels as I can, obviously, to, to save me time and stuff with the uh, wild battles and editing and stuff, because I'm going to be editing out quite a bit for the lucky egg, but like I say, I'm trying to do that after trainer battles straight away. Oh, another nice use of the 3D. I really like how they've done the 3D in it. I know they're a bit behind, but they're using some good 3D graphics. And according to my friend, it's going to be compatible with the 3DDS, but I don't believe it. Yes, I call it the 3DDS. I don't call it the 3DS, because it just doesn't sound right. <laughs> just, you're missing a D. You're missing a D. It's really annoying. You're missing a D, okay? But anyway, carrying on. Uh, supposedly it might be compatible with that, but I, 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 I don't remember reading anyway. It might be. I might be very ignorant. But, uh. Anyway, there's actually wild Pokemon on this bridge, but only in uh, if you hear a flapping of wings. You can get, um, it's a water flying type duck thing, can't remember what it's called. But if you were to, um, if you were to catch it, then that pretty much solves your HM worries because it can learn surf and fly. And obviously, when I get to fly, this music's quite funky. Mm -hmm. 
Um, when I get to that point, I'm just going to get a fly slave and fly around, and one Pokemon's just going to miss out on some experience fighting some random trainers. But I'll probably swap out Shimama, probably. Um, unless I need Flash at any point. Oh god. Oh, maybe I can find a slave that'll fly and has Flash. I don't know. Flash is really annoying, but you probably still need it even though it's TM. Really annoying. Anyway, and this, what's he doing here? He was meant to give me something, but he didn't. I don't remember exactly what. It was some sort of the thing. He wants to swap a Bizarro for a Chimari. Eh, it's not ideal. Anyway, that's pretty much it for this part. So, uh, I will uh, catch you in the next part. I'll record straight away after this. So, this has been Colson. Like, subscribe, etc. Watch, enjoy. Uh, catch you on the flip side.